Okay, so today I'm going to show you how to field strip a Sig Sauer P365. First thing you want to do is pop out the mag, make sure it's empty. And the gun is empty. And we've well, got the slide locked to the rear, which you can accomplish by pushing up on this lever and pulling back on the slide. Go ahead and rotate your takedown lever forward, just like that. And then let the slide go forward. You may or may not have to pull the trigger. Some, uh, some of the earlier models require you to pull the trigger. Go ahead and pull out your recoil spring guide rod assembly and the barrel. And that's how you field strip it. Now, while you've got it apart, you may want to clean it. And to do that, I would suggest making sure that these rails are clean, as well as your sear back here, and making sure this area is clean. And of course, cleaning out the uh, feed ramps and chamber and the bore on your barrel. To reassemble uh, this pistol, take the slide upside down uh, barrel upside down with the lugs up. Insert the barrel back into the slide. Your recoil spring guide rod assembly, the thin end, goes facing uh, the back of the gun. The thick end with the polymer cap here goes toward the front of the gun. And you have to kind of push it in and down just like that to where it seats. Now on some of these guns, this takedown lever likes to kind of pop back and to Get it back into the correct position, you simply push up on the slide stop and rotate that takedown lever back forward. Slide the uh, slide back onto the rails by lining it up with those rails and just pushing it straight back. Lock the slide to the rear, rotate the takedown lever back, and now that you've got it back together, uh, go ahead and do a function check by ensuring it's empty, pointing in safe direction. Pull the trigger, leave your finger depressed to the rear on the trigger, cycle the slide and then slowly let up off the trigger and you should hear and feel a little click. Just like that. All right, thank you very much for watching.